the countryside. We are on our way to Ntungamo from Kawale where we spent the night. Now we're making our way to, to the city. Yeah. After all the fun I had in Kisoro, even though I was just visiting for one day, it was super fun. Today our expedition sends us to Kasese district, but first, let us fuel the car. We have to shake the car in order for the fuel to get to the fullest. Anyhow, our expedition to Kasese takes us to a small village called Kahocha, where we're going to spread the gospel in a mini crusade. And then we're also going to share about HIV and AIDS to the community members because we believe HIV and AIDS is very common in villages and remote areas because people still have misconceptions of long ago. Now we, we're here to clear some air, but first I took a street tour. Okay guys, I'm walking <laughs> through the town and we're going up the mountain to get a spot where we can make calls. Like the only spot that has signal so we're going to walk to that area and i just asked this person taking me whether he does the same thing when when going to make calls and he said yes so huh? uh -uh. Okay, right here on this spot is where everyone comes to make the calls. <laughs> and this is the only spot that I signal. And now we're going to make the most of it. Wano Wendy, Musamba and Jaga. What is it? What is it? What is it? I was particularly uh, happy to visit Kasese because when you live in Kampala you get to think that everything good happens in Kampala but you will realize that as you drive away from Kampala and no matter what direction you go to you'll find a lot of things that are exciting and particularly I'm falling in love with the west part of the country because geez this is so beautiful I was so excited to see this river I'm so excited to see the hot springs I've never seen the hot springs I'm so excited to share with the people the language here is different in Kampala we speak a lot of Luganda but here we speak Rukonjo which is very difficult to, which is very difficult to speak but I'm excited to share with the people and I'm excited to see all these views that I've never seen and experience these things that I've not seen before it was really particularly exciting to visit the West and so far I'm saying the West is the most beautiful part of Uganda
We continue up north to Kavaroli district. Oh, what is famously known as Fort Porto. But before we get there, we have to tour the Kazinga Channel. Kazinga Channel is that little little thing that lies between Lake George and Lake Edward. But there is a lot to know about this, or there is a lot to learn about this Kazinga Channel. It is particularly nice to see all these things, to cross the equator, to see this nice road, to drive through this, this thick vegetation. It is super nice, and I'm particularly falling in love. Yeah. 